In this tutorial, we'll look at the FL Studio for OS X on a Mac Beta. This is a custom crossover wrapped version of FL Studio. So we have all the familiar FL Studio plugins and features such as the Step Sequencer. But it's not a native Mac application. The good news is that all but a few of the native plugins, such as Flowstone, work just as they do on Windows. And so do your MIDI controllers. Just connect them to your Mac, restart FL Studio, and they will show on the MIDI settings. Here I'm using a Novation Launchpad which is particularly cool to use with performance mode. Great. You can also record audio. I'll just select the audio input and record some parts into Edison. First, the guitar. Now the vocals, thanks to Laurie Webb. The way you leave me in the dark Aren't you clever? The way you space things apart feels like forever, and I can't predict the change. I'll take the opportunity to remind you that this version of FL Studio is not a native Mac application. It's the Windows version running in a crossover wrapper. So, outside the native plugins that install with FL Studio, we can't make any promises nor support compatibility issues with third party VST plugins that you may choose to install. The OS X version is provided as is. If it works for you, then great. If not, we recommend Bootcamp. If people find this version useful, over time we hope to improve and extend the capabilities, but we make no promises as to how or when. Please test it out on your Mac and let us know what does and doesn't work for you in our forums. The forum link, including where you can download the Mac installer, is in the video info. Enjoy! The way you leave me in the dark Aren't you clever? The way you space things apart Feels like forever